Hello. <clears throat> so here we are. My little weekly ride with me. I talk about what's been going on. So it's a little rainy today, so I guess it's kind of dark. Sorry about that. But got a couple things. As far as the cleaning business, I don't know. There was a little over a year ago, I posted a video about two of my customers that passed away. It was so sad. But it was one of those bittersweet things because the wife had passed away. And then a few months later, the husband, he passed away. And he, he was just so broken hearted, you know. Anyway, um, this weekend, the son called me to do a move out clean on their house. They're putting it up for sale. So that was, you know, it was one of those things. I really like those people. I really, really like them a lot. And they're, they're just, they were, the whole family's a very nice family. So I felt like it was my way to say goodbye and do the my last final cleaning for them you know and they had an open house the next day and hopefully they'll get somebody to buy the house for a good price quickly you know that's that's the plan so that's what's going on with the cleaning business not much new there um but the reselling business so this is really what i want to talk about okay so i have been using flip the flip sharer for Poshmark and I love it by the way I love it when I, when I first started using it um, <laughs> because you know you have to share and share and share right uh, that first day or two I was like now what do I get what am I supposed to be doing you know I felt like I was not doing something that I should have been doing so it really is a time saver and I'm still playing around with it trying to um, get a strategy for the bulk share because and it may take some time just because you know I've just started using it and so some of my shares have been send you know uh, lower the price kind of thing but what I did yesterday was um, I went through like throughout the day and I increased the amount of the discount and lessened or uh, I guess you say I increased so I was up to 60% but excluding things from the last 45 days so it would have been like in the things that really would have been almost 60 days old and I would have you know they're just about ready to relist I had a real deep discount on those so hopefully you know some of those things will sell before I have to relist them uh, it's just a strategy I don't know if it's gonna work or not but I guess we'll figure that out <laughs> but here's the thing okay so I'm working cleaning yesterday and I occasionally do look to see if you know I've had any sales or anything and I turned the notifications off on Poshmark on my phone because it would go off constantly all day long between people sharing, people following, live sales coming on. It's just annoying to have so many notifications. So I turned it off, right? <laughs> Which means I have to go in and look here and there to see what's going on. <clears throat> so I'm seeing, you know, new likes but no new offers. And I'm like something happened to my flip at home which <coughs> excuse me I've had this cough for a week now every um, every morning I set it up to run throughout the day right and then so I can tell when I'm out whether or not it's doing what it's supposed to be and yesterday it wasn't okay let's see to go around this trash truck so when I get home I say hi to my cat and I said I looked at the computer and it was in sleep mode and you know it won't work if it's in sleep right and I looked at the cat and I was like what did you do to my computer and Ray says she was sitting on the keyboard well that was my fault I left my laptop on the bed you know and she owns the house so she felt it was her 
prerogative to go and sit on my keyboard and she did something and put the computer into sleep mode so I didn't get any of my shares in yesterday my offers were behind you know all the things that I wanted to do didn't get done oh, well that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes you know so today I made sure once I had everything set up that I put it somewhere where Miss Pris Snickers could not walk on it or was less likely maybe to walk on it so that's my life but, you know, I'm loving the flip because it does get the sharing in. And I, I don't know how it knows about the capture things, but it does, it takes care of those. And um, I'm getting in all of my shares through the day, not just mine, but sharing in the community. And I know that's controversial, but I think that when, when a product tells you this is how how to use our product most effectively, you need to follow the directions, right? And it, Poshmark wants you to share other closets, so I do that. And um, I am noticing, a, 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 well, my sales are going up for one thing. I am getting more sales, uh, and I'll talk to, to you about that in a second, because it's not just flip, but also, um, I'm using this perfectly and the two together I'm telling you it's a game changer but um, I'm noticing that my followers are increasing as well so it has made a difference and it's it saved me so much time so much time you know now that I've adjusted to not having to stop and share so many times throughout the day um, you know I can do other things on some of the other platforms and so on and so forth so that's what's going on with Poshmark with eBay because I've been using um, list perfectly and it's funny too because it's like every other week eBay and Poshmark have been alternating which one's gonna be the great producer for that week so last week was eBay's week and um, we'll see what happens this week and um, the list perfectly I absolutely love that I it has made such a difference in my life so really what I'm doing is on days where I'm not cleaning I focus on getting the listings into list perfectly the pictures and the descriptions and usually the price and the weight you know so that all I have to do when it's time to list on all of the platforms that I want to list something on it's all ready to go and it and I can do that at night or early in the morning you know every day so I can meet my daily goals and we know how um, all of the platforms they want you to continuously list that's how you increase your sales and so it really has made a huge difference as far as me being more organized and um, getting my listings out and I don't feel like every single day I have to take pictures and go through all of that because sometimes I just don't feel like it you know I'm tired when I get home this cleaning is taking a toll on my body and and even though it's a lot easier to list you know take pictures and things like that than it is climbing up and down stairs so on and so forth um, I still don't want to you know have to bend over and all lift boxes and whatever I have to do I just don't feel like it but I can sit there and relax and get my listings out so it that has really made a huge difference for me huge difference and um, <clears throat> a couple little tricks that I've learned with list perfectly so you know when uh, on eBay somebody buys something but they haven't paid for it yet one of the th tricks that I'm doing is I'll go ahead and I'll mark it sold in list perfectly that way I don't sell it on Mercari or Poshmark or anything but you know on those occasions when the time goes by and they still haven't they're not gonna pay for it it's so easy to go back and just relist it I don't have to um, you know it's not such an ordeal as it is when before list perfectly came around so there's that I really like that and I did have a return recently 
um, on, a, on a piece of clothing and um, when I got it back because it was marked sold and I had it in list perfectly all I had to do was just relist it I you know I just reposted it and took the sold off and so that was also just so much easier than having to read picture and all the things that you have to do so you know there's lots of different ways that list perfectly has made my life easier and more effective as far as um, getting things done quicker and more efficiently and I really it's just been amazing and I was looking at my um, stats this morning and I have I mean it, it's been crazy how much my sales have increased like a hundred percent over last month or the month before and even over last year um, so it's six or six months into the year my sales have increased uh, so you know and I know what it is it's because I'm actually doing the work you know and the tool that I'm using has made made a difference so yay list perfectly I really recommend it you know it's it's about what is it thirty dollars a month I think it is it's worth every penny you you will pay for it um, it, it'll pay for itself with the, the sales that you make so it is definitely worth the investment so that is that going on oh and one other thing this is kind of exciting um, I listen to podcasts when I'm cleaning and one of the podcasts that I listen to is my chaotic closet she's a reseller uh, her name is Michelle and she's uh, in California and I listened to her podcast, so she had said, you know, if you want to be interviewed, uh, reach out to me on Instagram. So I did. I reached out to her, and um, we did an interview a couple nights ago. She hasn't posted it yet, but, um, you know, it was so much fun, and it was, it was good to talk to somebody who's... I mean, hers is different from mine, of course. You know, everybody's a little bit different. But still in the same mindset, you know, of somebody who's serious about doing the reselling. And I, I really, I just had such a great time talking to her. And I'm going to talk to her tomorrow night on my podcast, which is eBay at Attic Tells All. So um, I'll have her interview coming up here pretty soon on my podcast. It's really, really cool. That is so cool. So, um, some things that are interesting, and I've, it's good to just, you know, make a new friend. Somebody who understands what you go through when you're reselling. And um, so, that was kind of neat, too. So, those are the things that have been going on this last week or so. <clears throat> um, I'm trying to think, did I make any really great sales? Mm, not anything particularly wonderful, you know, no big dollar sales but a lot more of regular sales and that in itself is so satisfying so I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing and keep growing and I hope you do the same I hope you enjoy these little ride-alongs when I talk about you know what I'm doing through the week different things that are on my mind sometimes I just babble but um, if you do like them don't forget to subscribe if you have questions, you want to know something about my reselling life or even my cleaning business, which I'm not putting a lot of effort into anymore, <laughs> I'm just kind of maintaining it. Or um, if you like the video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate every one of you and I appreciate that you took the time to watch my videos. So thanks so much. Everybody have a great day and uh, I'll get back to you again. Okay, have a good one.